multiply lesson on writing numbers in standard form. In mathematics, we write numbers in standard form when a number is very large or very small. Say, for instance, here, we have a diameter of a sun is 1.39 billion meters, which is obviously a difficult number to work and calculate with. So standard form provides us an easier way of working with these type of numbers. So we'll begin by writing 320 in standard form. Now, standard form means you have a number between 1 and less than 10, multiplied by a power of 10. So 320 can be written as 3.2 multiplied by 100. We've chosen 100 because that is a power of 10, which is 10 squared. So we have 3.2 multiplied by 100. 1,600. The power of 10 would be 1,000, and it is 1 1.6 multiplied by 1,000. We can write 1,000 as 10 to the 3. So 1,600 can be written as 1 1.6 times 10 to the 3. Question C, 48,900. To write it as a power of 10, we have 4.89 multiplied by 10,000. 10,000 we can write as 10 to the power of 4. You can see we have four zeros. So in standard form it is 4.89 times 10 to the power of 4. And for question D we have 1,800,000. In standard form we have 1.8 times 1 million and one million has six zeros. So it is 1.8 times 10 to the power of six. Okay, let's try some more questions. So do you want to try and match the ordinary and standard form numbers yourselves? by pausing the video and you can resume it when you're ready. Okay, we'll begin with 365,000. You can see we have 3.65 multiplied by 100,000, which is 3.65 multiplied by 10 to the power of 5. So this one matches with this one. For 3,650, we have 3.65 multiplied by 1,000. So 3.65 multiplied by 10 to the power of 3. So this one matches with this one. For 36,500, we have 3.65 multiplied by 10,000. So 3.65 multiplied by 10 to the power of 4. So this would match with this. And 3.65, we're multiplying this by 1, which has zero zeros. So this is 3.65 times 10 to the power of 0. And this 0 means that there are no zeros here. Anything to the power of 0 is always 1. And this value matches with this value. And finally, 36.5 we write as 3.65 times 10, which is 3.65 times 10 to the power of 1. So, as you would expect, this one matches with this one. Thank you very much for watching. I hope you found that useful. Thanks again and take care.